Hey y'all, welcome and welcome back. Thank you so much for stopping by. So today I wanted to show you guys, I finally... Hi! <laughs> and Mila is also here. I wanted to show y'all, I finally got my Julio. And this is a Julio Campagna in gold, um, with gold rings. Oh, I am so in love. Bye. Mainly, bye! She, um, my oldest daughter just took her, her, just took her out. They went to the mall, walked around, and she bought a few things for her. Whatever they just got home. Um, I'm still. I just had surgery a few days ago, and I'm still recovering and getting around around very slowly. Um, and so they'll kind of like take her off my hands for a little bit because right now it's fall break also. So. <laughs> I'm like, I'm so sorry. Like, we're stuck at home for fall break. But um, they've been they've been great. My kids are amazing. Um, but I wanted to show y'all, like, look how easily it, like, snaps. And I think, um, okay, because I had just did a video about unchunking my planner. And then I just went back and, like, chunked it up. <laughs> um, I think it's a little less chunky than it was. But it's. I added a few, a few more things since that last video. Of course, of course. Um, but it just like snaps so much easier. But I think it's also because of this this cover. Like, um, it's, and I, now I know why people like love these, but it's just like, I guess so really soft and like, it's a lot thinner too. So I feel like it doesn't make it look as crazy bulky as the Moterm. Like, I love the Moterm too, like, um, but it's like thicker and harder. It's not as bendy <laughs> or if that's even a word as this, like it's, I'm just, I'm so in love with this right now, y'all. Like, I don't, I don't know why I took this long to finally buy one. Um, <laughs> but I got it from my friend Diana. She had it on Mercari and she had told me about it actually a while ago and I was like oh, okay you know like I'll look at it I'll think about it and then I was like I never I don't know I just couldn't make myself buy it and then finally she was like hey it's still in there and I was just like oh okay you know like I'll think about it again um and I kept going in there and the app and looking at it and looking at it and I would look at more videos and I'm like, oh, well, what's the difference? You know, like, is it worth it? I'm so glad I did it. I finally just went and did it. Um, and I just, I love it so much. Um, it's just really soft. I can't, I can't stop playing with it. <laughs> Messing with it. But, um, look, so here's the top view. Um, so yeah, I think, um, it's not as chunky as it was before of, but it it is uh I did add more things after taking things out. Um because I'm like I need it. I need it in there. I can't not have it. So and we'll do a really quick um flip. I'm gonna try to make it quick. All my videos are so long. <laughs> so I need to be better about like getting things said and done. And I think I need to move this because it keeps getting like pulled up. Um, peeled up on the edges there and I don't like that let me see if I can um, this is I got this from um, simply create doodles and oops is it gonna mess up the nope we're fine oh my god that's amazing looks like nothing ever was there <laughs> Um, okay, so where can I put this? Um, yeah, so we're going to go through and just look at all the things. I'm going to put that on one of these. Let's do it on here. That way it'll be safe. <laughs> Okay. 
Okay, I love that. All right, so here we go. Um, also, um, I don't have as much things back here in the back. I also, um, I think that was what was causing a lot of the bulkiness as well. So I went through here and like just took out stuff that like I don't need. Um, so in the front, it's just this. And then I added a picture of me and my two youngest. Um, this stuff is still the same as my Moterm. The bag pockets though, so they're a little different than the Moterm. Moterm? Um, there's like six, like, oh no, there's not six, there's eight, um, like business slots right here, business card slots. So that's going to kind of take me a little bit to kind of figure out what I want in here. Um, so for now I just kind of threw in here what was in my Moterm. Um, and then this is from when Diana gave me the package she had, um, let me see if I so she gave me these They're so cute and then she gave me um it's like a pack little pack of these like bows and I think I have them in here somewhere um these right here so it's just like a little pack of like they're not sticky so they're just like notepad like a notepad of bows but this one she put the sticker on it and I thought it was perfect and I had to have it in my planner somewhere where I would see it kind of often um it says for I know the plans I have for you declares the Lord Jeremiah 29 11 um I'm a breast cancer survivor and it being October um which is breast cancer awareness month I was like this is perfect <laughs> to like showcase in my planner so yeah, thank you, Diana. I love that. Um, and so here I had, so I cut up a few of these, and this was just the bottom of it. I cut it to put in here, and I just wanted that bottom to kind of show right there. So, let's see. Um, so I still have this as my cover. My little October month thing that I created. And then I also created these, and these are just like, scary movies um that we're wanting to watch this month this i changed out so that was um let me see if i have it in here somewhere mm, somewhere okay so here is how the month um that i used to have and then i just made it a little cuter <laughs> i like I said, I or I don't know if I said it, but I just had surgery here recently. I think I did say that um, a few days ago, and I'm still recovering. So I haven't been able to, been able to do much, but like sit at my desk and play. <laughs> so I've been creating like all the inserts and doing all the things. Um, I've been having fun making these like word search things for... Um, just like people who follow me, I've just been, I've been going down the list and um, putting their names in like a little word search puzzle. Um, it's been keeping me busy. <laughs> and so I just released actually uh, the number two. Um, so if you don't follow me on Instagram, you want to, if you like word searches, um, I have two of them out. Um, actually, I'll link it down below too if you guys want to look at that. But um in my Dropbox. Anyway, so I can't find the old one, but anyway, it said live here and then it had some quotes or whatever. And I just wanted it something more simple, but something that just like popped out because that's my word for the year. <clears throat> and then that's the new 2024 holidays. Um, and then I also changed this up around a, just a tad bit, not too much. So that's what the old one looked like. And this is a new one and I have the leaves going down here on the sides. I thought that was cute. Okay, and then that's still the same. This is the 2024 calendar. I always like to have them kind of together somewhere um, to reference. I really don't use this one much. Um, but I like to have it for reference because if we're like planning a trip or anything, I like to look 
easy access to like, okay, what days and stuff like that. And then also around this time, my husband starts, they have to start planning like their, um, their time off or whatever from work. And so we kind of like to look at the dates and, and all that. It's handy. Um, this is a little quote that uh, my friend Monique, she sent to um, a few of us. Uh, I think it was last year. Um, and I just, it really stood out to me. I really loved um, what it says. And I love looking at that as a constant reminder that if you want to be happy, you have to be happy on purpose. When you wake up, you can't just wait to see what kind of day you'll have. You have to decide what kind of day you'll have. And I like, amen. <laughs> I totally agree with that. And then this is my like year at a glance of like, um, events and stuff. Though. So that's Taylor. I did take out the Haru plans um, that I had in here because I was like, this is nice and I love looking at it, but it's pretty much like my monthly calendar. Um, I was just like, it was repetitive. So I was like, I don't need that. Um, this my little Starbucks coffee thing. I love that. And then read more, scroll less. So I had only the books, um, the 30 book thing in here, but I changed it and I added, <laughs> I made these so cute. I, I love how they turned out. I love the butterflies and the colors. So I made a t new TBR list, which I have, um, I haven't started reading yet. I need to, I'm going to start today, but I have the boyfriend that everybody's been raving about. Um, so I'm going to start reading tonight and then these are all the books I have read, um, so far this year. And then I have enough space here for my 30 that I want to do before the end of the year. So we shall see. So any book suggestions I would love if you could give me, um, so I can fill this up <laughs> so I can get to my 30. So, so far I have the boyfriend, which I'm about to start tonight. And Never Lie, which is also a Frida McFadden book. Um, so yeah, any other kind of suggestions, I would love to hear. Um, and then we can chat about that. <laughs> so yeah, that's still there too. My holiday stuff, it's still the same. Um, I have not added my Christmas yet. I'm still working on a you like I'm tweaking the ones that I had so I'm gonna add that in there which won't be that much um, my little picture thing I made then I have uh, my inbox so I moved that to the front um, with my little planning guide that I created and so that has all my inbox things um, I'm still deciding if I need this in here or not. <laughs> I don't know. I, like I always, I think I did take it out at one point and it lasted like five minutes before I put it back in. So <laughs> I don't know. It really doesn't do much, but hold these little things for me. But I ended up putting slits in it so I can like move it around. Um, you know, if I don't like it there, I can move it around. So we'll see. Um, so then this is my, um, this whole thing right here is like my planning H. section. What, baby? H. Oh, that is an H. Good job. See, guys, H. The letter H. Good job. Because I made a candy that is a letter. Yes. Um, so all of this is still the same. Um, and so I... The only thing I did is I added these, so I made these, um, just lamination sheets that I sent in the laminator by themselves. <laughs> um, I loved it because it's clear, but it'll give me the like tab at the top that I need so I can just like quickly go to it, but it doesn't block my view. Um, and that, cause I had this one in there but it blocks my view and I don't I don't like that <laughs> I had to keep taking it out pulling it out I don't know I'm just like 
this one I tolerate because it, he's just too cute. And so I don't mind it. But I also, I'll like pull it out. Um, and I can see because this is clear. I love that so much. Um, but I'm just going to do with my, probably with my Cricut. If not, I'm going to see if I have any labels that just say monthly. And I'm going to write that on there. Um, and then these are my Halloween sticky notes that I created. And then it goes to my weekly, which I did the same thing, just like a clear one, just thinner. Um, and now I've added this moon, but that's okay. Um, and then I can go to my, which I'm going to make this tab a little smaller too, so I can get this. Oh, cool. Um, I love you guys. Um, that's too cute, Mila. <laughs> so then it goes into my daily section, and Mila, she did this for me, and so she's like, it's for your planner, so I had to put it in my planner, and then I added one of those Target sticky note things in the back, just <laughs> to hold more pictures. Um, then I, this is one of the quotes that was in that front before, and I just cut it out and stuck it right here and then this is my dailies uh, section um, so then after that I put my lists and my notes right here so here's my list my all my to-do stuff so I, I added this one a uh, new that I add created and added and then I created this one as well I need to buy so it's not like groceries, it's need to buy like, for instance, like my daughter, she needs a bigger softball bag, um, but she doesn't need it like at this moment, like softball is almost over. We're doing our post season next week, but just to know for next fall or next, um, the spring season, she needs a bigger bag. Um, and this, my kids need fall clothes and that's more <laughs> like right now, but, um, I had to write down there because I need to remember to do that. Um, none of their fall clothes from last year fit. Like, none. A few of their, like, hoodies, which is good because hoodies are expensive. But none of their, like, pants or anything. Like, long sleeve shirts. <laughs> none of that fits anymore. Ugh, kids grow so fast. So that's wish list. And then uh, my planner wish list, which I've already, I've done three of the four that I've had on there. My next thing to get is a J Creatives pouch. I've been looking at those everywhere. This last one that she did, um, I just, I really, I don't know. I need to go look again, but I wasn't really like loving the fabric designs on that one. Um, the one that I wanted, it sold out fast. So <laughs> maybe next time. So um, yeah. And then on this side is just like freebies. And if I'm watching like a video um, YouTube video or something I write it down which I haven't <laughs> I've only got two and I know there's a lot more people out there with freebies so I need to I need to look S M L. oh nice good job M N L. thank you baby good job um and I just I've, I know there's a few others, but like they only have um, like personal size or pocket size. Not very many people do things in personal wide. Um, so that's why I just create a lot of my own stuff because it's hard <laughs> to like find what I need in the size that I need it in. And then it's my notes section. Um, and then here's where I have cut um, those ones that Diana sent me she's like the sweetest thing ever i love her we've become like pretty good friends um we chat a lot um on instagram and stuff and she's so awesome um okay so then in my oh in my notes section well okay yeah so then um this i added i love i love that it's so cute and then so this um, I brought back my little home section, um, but it's smaller than I had before. So I just have my vehicle maintenance, uh, a page, 
online order page, just one. Um, and then I figured once that's done, like it's nothing that I'm going to need to save. So I'll just take it out, put another one in. And then these are the meal ideas. So one's for us, one is for stuff that my kids will actually eat. Um, or foods that my kids will actually eat. And then I have my little sticky notes that I created. Um, so I created these meal plans and these grocery list ones. And I. Good job, baby. T-I, guys. Oop. Good job. Um, let's see. I love you, Mom. <laughs> we love you, Mila. Sorry, guys. Um, and these are the ones that I she gave me as well. I think those are beautiful. And then my little brain dump, uh, brain on fire guy that I created as well. Um, more pictures. And then this goes to my school section. We have another Spirit Week, the end of October. And this is my daughter's list already. They haven't posted my son's yet. Um, these are the cute little like lunch ones that I made for them for school lunch. Um, their classroom goals and their homework ones. And then, um, so that's still the same these I created I posted them on my Instagram or put, I did a reel on them I'm so proud of how these turned out so instead of doing I had like the full the peanuts planner co peanuts planner co fold out I have this thing and it was it was fine it was working okay um but the thing is that it's a 2000, it's a 2024 Mommy, calendar. And so for, and so why? for, huh? Why? 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 Yep. Good guys, why? Good job. Um, so then the thing is, after Mommy, December, um, January through June love is, you, love you, baby. Um, these won't work because they're 2024. <laughs> And so I kept trying to think of a way to change that. And I was just going to try to create a little mini calendar and put it on top of those to keep using this. But then I was like, you know what? I need something that's going to work a little bit better for me. And so I created these and then I was able to go ahead and like already fill in all of the school. So instead of it having being like a list of stuff like this, um, I can actually see it like and in a calendar form and it's like um works perfectly and then i can use it for like the day if they ever miss a day or if they're sick um if i check them out early whatever i can write it here and or any other information i can put down here like party info whatever and it's all like in the month and i love i love how they turned out like each month i tried to create it um like decorate it and it's just so cute i'm so proud of these um so as you see like everything's like pre-filled in all their days off their virtual days etc um and there's other things like picture day and stuff like that that's not announced ahead of time so um it still gives me room to write um in each one of these and i i'm just so i'm so happy with how they turned out um, then my little one's school schedule and her list of snack ideas for the classroom. Um, yes. Yeah. Yes. My son's schedule. So all of this P other stuff is still the same. P Z K. B Z what? K? I said B. Yeah. B K. Z K. Per Z. Perfect. P Z. P. <laughs> B B <laughs> and Z Z and K K okay <laughs> um and all this other stuff is still the same okay and then I have my like me section um which is all of this right here um so it's all the same as well. I don't know if I've showed this on YouTube yet, but this is that perpetual plans 
insert and it's blank. And so I went ahead and added this quote. Um, I don't know if I had it in my last video or not, but I just, I, that really stood out to me. And I was like, that is so very true. Um, and then I think I've showed this one already um, that I made. I saw a picture of this on Pinterest <laughs> and then I just recreated it. Um, my trackers that I never track, <laughs> except this, this I've been staying on top of <clears throat> and this one. Um, okay, so I have all of that still the same. And then my, this is my workout stuff. Okay. And then it's like my planner section. So I made these cute little inserts as well with the moon. I love the moon. Um, and then just like, these are like notes for me. Um, little journaling, personal journaling stuff or whatever it goes in here. And then after that, it's my family section. And um, so I just have little sticky notes that I create for them. The little picture, little flower for my baby girl. And then this quote too that I love. That's all the same. All of this is still the same. Um, her party stuff, all the, all the info, all of the notes about my family is in here. And then our health stuff. So, um, let's see. So I still have that all the way to December. And then I have our medication list. And then I added a contacts um, to write like all our doctor's info and stuff. And then I have like questions that we need to ask the doctor. Any kind of like health tips or tricks or whatever. Like I am starting to move more into like... Um, natural like health remedies and stuff uh, my grandma's um she would always tell us about things that we for us to do if we had a cold if we had this or that or whatever so i have a lot of like her stuff in here that she would always prescribe <laughs> prescribe to us um and then just other stuff that i've kind of like um been looking into instead of giving my kids all these um, over-the-counter medications all the time and myself um and then here's the fun uh, spot in my uh, planner. So here's like that planner bay word search that I was telling you all about. I, I created this with um, just like planner people that, um, planner friends on Instagram. Um, I've been doing it little by little. Um, this is number one. M X H and Tea. Oh, good job. All together. Good. And so I just created number two and I haven't printed it yet, but I'll add that in here as well. Um, but I thought it was just something fun to do kind of, you know, it's fun seeing your name on things. And so I figured that would be the case on a lot of y'all's <laughs> for a lot of y'all as well. And also it helps like to kind of like see other people's like handles, like if like oh I don't follow them and, you know you can go check them out and give them a follow or you know you never know if you might like some other content and so that's kind of like another thing to like help people kind of see who all is out there um so that's been fun to do um and then this one is from the friends um what's it called it was like a friend's word search that I saw that I bought at the Dollar Tree so these have been fun too I just as soon as I do them finish them I just take them out um and I want to add a few more other fun things my daughter and I we play a lot of um like tic-tac-toe and things like that and we usually do it in like my notes section paper but I think I'm going to go ahead and like pre-print some like already done that way it'll just be a little little fun section for her and I then my mom B plan section. This is from Simply Create Doodles. 
And so this, um, I also made these as well. So these are my Instagram and YouTube. And so these little hearts are just to show when I post on Instagram, um, like an actual post, not stories. Um, I was going to do reels, but then I started just doing, <laughs> doing it. And I was like, oh, I didn't want to like white out the whole thing. So I'm just doing posts. <laughs> Anytime I post is anything. Um, it's there. And then my Instagram follower tracker, my, um, when I post a YouTube video, it's all the little hearts. This day I posted three videos in one day. I was like, what? I even went back to like double check. <laughs> I was like, what was going on with me that day? Um, I didn't remember that I did that. So that was pretty cool to see. <laughs> um, but yeah, so just to see. And like, there's been like times where I've gone way too long. And I'm like, so yeah, I need to get better about doing that. Um, I know in the summer, it was really hard for me to just sit and do anything. So yeah, so I made those as well. Let's see. And then that's more of mommy plans stuff and then I have my boss babe section and after that um I have my finance section so I have my like um my bills at a my yearly bill tracker which I need to update um and then I have my monthly it's just like a month the calendar. I think it's this one's um, Peanuts Planner Co. And they're all filled out. But anyway, so I write down when my bill is due, how much, and then I'm white it out um, once it's like cleared my bank. Um, and then I have this. Maybe. Then I have these in there. And this is how I separate. So um, my husband gets paid every two weeks, so it's usually twice a month. And so I just divide it like this. So I take all the bills and I see what's due when, which one will be paid with what bill, with what paycheck, I mean. And this is how I write it out. And then I go in, I, have to, I go through a whole process and it's probably a lot, <laughs> but I I like to be very detailed, especially when it comes to money. Um, so once I decide what's getting paid, when then I go and I do these these are the budget mom um thing and I just sized them down to fit this planner and I added these in the bottom because it was like empty space um but then I go in detail of like okay so for that month um, I mean for this paycheck um these are the bills and then I go into like my sinking funds and all that and all that other fun stuff and then this is just my like check register to show where the money is going and then this one I created a little savings um, challenge and this is um, to pay for my daughter's dance uh, competitions which are coming up early next year <laughs> so yeah and then this is my um, I have these so I'll put these in my weeks when um, the week is going on <clears throat> I had it in this one and I just I took it off because I don't want to show people like info but anyway I took these out to do this flip but I keep those in my weekly and I'm writing down as I'm spending and then I come in here and update my check registry and then I have my passwords which I'm definitely not going to show <laughs> and then here I had a whole bunch of like sticky notes and stuff and I'm like I really don't use those since I've been making my own now. I hardly used was using the ones that were back here. So I just left it clear like this. Um, yeah, and then back here I have... So my friend Diana, she's so sweet. She also sent me these like Halloween um, stickers, like these kits, sets. What are these called? Kits? Sticker kits? Um, they're so, so cute. So I figured I'd leave them in here and not put them up somewhere because then I'll forget to use them. Um, yeah, they're so cute. So I have these back here and then these from the Budget Mom as well for when I go to the bank. And if I need cash back a certain way. Um, 
but yeah that is that's it y'all um so I've kind of have like kind of downsized it a bit um I was still able to add back uh, some stuff that I was enjoying in here I didn't want to get rid of everything everything because then I knew I wouldn't enjoy flipping through it or looking through it or using it um but see, I even have stuff that my daughter does for me um but yeah I've been adding so many like personal touches and stuff and I love it so much and I love it even better in this new Jillio um the only thing is because I use this pen um because my blue one died I usually like this pen um but it it died it <laughs> rest in peace it um the ink I mean it's done I've used it all up and so I ordered some more but for the meantime I've been using this one and it's too too chunky for this loop so it doesn't if I put it in if I try to shove it in there I don't know if I'll be able to like <laughs> see I'm scared to even shove it in there um so I'll either put it in this one here like that and it'll close or I just like what I have been doing since I really haven't been going anywhere because I've been recovering I just do that and put this right here and it's perfect <laughs> but um yeah so that's that is what has been going on um I'm I'm in love with it I love it so much uh thanks again for watching thank you so much for being here I love you guys so much um but yeah so I just um wanted to share with y'all. I hope y'all have a wonderful weekend. Um, I love y'all. Bye-bye.